what we have been really um, advocating is the uh, importance of the role of parents. Uh, even, um, I would emphasize po, no, our war on drugs po talaga. Because we've seen young people involved in, in the, in the um, trade, trade po talaga. The, the thing that we see here is yung parental guidance po talaga eh. Uh, the moral fiber of a child comes from, from home po talaga eh. We, we have to, to see that first. Uh, Mag-uumpisa po talaga sa magulang. Uh, sabi nga niyo po kanina, it takes uh, a village to raise a child. It is true. But of course, it begins at home. Sabi nga po natin. So, uh, yun po yung nakikita natin. Uh, it is also true, as the good congressman has mentioned, we have a law that criminalizes parents uh, neglecting their children. And at the, at the beginning of... Um, this, this government, the presidency, we started implementing po yung curfew hours. Uh, and of course, to our surprise, talagang ang nag-complain, yung magulang pa, no? Na bakit daw hinuhuli namin yung mga, I mean, ina-apprehend yung mga bata. And then, uh, unfortunately, there was a TRO file. We stopped the, the implementation dahil po talagang kailangan namin sumunod sa kung ano man po yung iuutos sa atin. Uh, interestingly, we also tried to um, file cases against parents. We received both you know, even more negative feedback no, from the public na bakit natin kinukulong yung magulang. Uh, but uh, the law defines, no, 7610 defines na neglect of children. Mm -hmm. we, we can file cases against parents. What is so difficult also is the mm. fact that sa isang um, ganitong klaseng nangyayari, it always um, boils down to ano ang ginaw, ang gagawin ng parents. Because sasabihin, ma'am, hindi na po namin talaga kaya. Ang tigas-tigas po ng ulo ng mga batang yan. And there are some cases where the parents themselves send the children to, yes. Yes, to, to work as drug couriers. Yes, yes. yes. Diba? that's the Ay, fact. Na Yun na nga po yeah. yung nagiging problema. Yeah. Kasi sila mismo yung gumagawa ng ganito. As far as I know, um, our, some of our church members na bata, they know na how to mag-ayos ng foil. Kasi it's their job na magtupi nung tupi. foil for <coughs> yung para gamitin, for shabu. For shabu. Mm -hmm. Tapos sabi niya, bakit ganyan ginagawa niyo? Kasi po kikita po ako ng one peso per foil pag ginawa ko po ito. Mm -hmm. So that's the only way na parang for me na makasustain ako na pumasok sa school yung allowance mm -hmm. na makakuha ko dito.